what's good youtube this is mark today i'm going to show you guys how to recolor your smudge artwork right inside of photoshop well this video is a full part of everything of all my smudge process in photoshop but all is on the speed video so you have to wait to the midpoint of this video where i'm really going to show you guys how to recolor your artwork that is really going to make it look more realistic and make it look so nice Once you are done smudging, merge all layers together and convert that into a smart object. Then go over to select and then color range. From the drop down menu, select the mid tones and that is going to make a selection of your mid tones present on your subject. So from there now, add the layer marks to that layer. You will be left only with the mid tones which you just selected from the color range. Now grab your color picker and pick that mid tones. Then after picking the mid tones, delete the layer marks from there. Then go over to the solid color, create a new solid color layer. That will automatically have the skin tone which you just pick so now right there after creating the solid color layer set the blend mode to color that will make the color blend with your skin and after setting the blend mode to color you want to hit on ctrl i on your keyboard to invert the layer mask which will automatically turn your layer mask into black and every color you have on your skin will disappear grab any soft round brush of your choice and start painting over the skin as you can see right here now that will start revealing the color or the skin tune on the certain area or the particular area where you really want this color to overlay on and sometimes when you are done painting you get to see that the color is not being applied on everywhere you really want this to be now to fix this on time all you have to do double click on that adjustment layer which you just created or the solid color layer which you just created now before playing around with the colors make sure to hit on ctrl c on your keyboard to pick the color which you already have there as your skin tune then from that color picker option play around with any color as you can see right here i have a color like a silver overlaying on my subject now this is really going to help me see the places which the color have not touched so right now you can see that every part is being covered properly because the color of my skin tune is totally different from the color overlaying but if you have the same color of the skin tune you won't know where and where you paint and the places you will not paint so with this method you will be able to paint over everywhere of your skin tune having the proper colors overlaying on every part of your skin tune And when you are painting, make sure that you don't want this to overlay on every other part of your subject like the eyeballs 
in the lips just as you can see right here i'm trying to be careful on the lips part and most especially when i get to where the eye is i just try for this not to really affect the eyes but there are several ways to fix these but at first you don't really want this to touch all those places you just want to concentrate on only the skin which is your main goal right here Once you are done painting over the whole skin, now the next thing for you to do is to double click on that solid color layer again to open up your color picker and this time around paste back the color code which you copy before and after pasting back the color code it is really going to have the skin tone which you picked before. So right now you can proceed with every other step which you really want to use in editing your smudge app. So that brings us to the end of this video and I hope this really helped you guys apply a new color or recolor your skin tint to make it look so nice and cool well if you're not subscribed yet make sure to hit that subscribe button and not just the subscribe button ring the bell icon so that you don't miss any new tips and tricks i'll be posting every week so the remaining part of this video is going to be a speed process so just relax and enjoy